Hello everyone. Welcome back to my channel, Twisted Paper Studio. How are you? I hope that you are all well. Uh, let's read our dragon cards today and then we'll get started with a little project. It's day 62, you guys. Monday, day 62 of the 100 Day Craft Project. Thank you so, so very much <laughs> for, for everything for yesterday. Um, it was so sweet to see the comments and support. I'm very grateful. It wasn't what I was looking for. I'm so appreciative of it. I did the video um, because I just didn't want to be alone. And um, I wasn't. <laughs> I was with all of you. And I'm so appreciative of everyone's comments. I'll answer them when I go into town today um, to upload this video. So we got the tea dragon today, you guys. Relax. The tea dragon. Um, this is a cute little dragon with a nice little message. Let's see what the message is. Relax. <sighs> What's your hurry right now? If you're feeling anxious or rushed, it is time to make time for yourself. The tea dragon reminds you that you should relax with a nice cup of this lizard's namesake. In preparing the tea, breathe through the time it takes to boil the water. Then perhaps you could sit quietly for the steeping time. As you drink in the hot liquid, remind yourself that it is a gift you give to others when you relax. You can deal with the stresses of the world better by indulging in your own tea ceremony. So true. So the habitat for the tea dragon, let's read that. Warm and wet surroundings appeal to this garden dragon. It requires a great deal of moisture, even being one of the aquatic, loving, flying wonders. They share a love of hot water spots with their cousins, the coffee dragon. Over 75% of tea dragons are found in Asia and Africa. Wow, that's pretty cool. He's so cute, the tea dragon. Okay, let us give our blessings. Um... Let me give my beautiful blessing. Oh, and start my timer. Let me start my timer. Start and give my beautiful blessings. Um, thank you again for all your blessings and peaceful comments yesterday. Um, beautiful blessings to um, Eureka. Beautiful blessings to you, Eureka. Brenda Hall and Annette P. Charlotte. Uh, Beverly, Suzanne's Craft Room, Lori Riddle, Sharon, and Celeste, Deb Wilson, Joy Crisiti, and Sherry Vanderpool. Beautiful blessings to you. Thank you so much. Okay, let's get started with today's craft. So, um, let's see. I'm going to gather some little papers. And um, I took this little paper and I and I uh, punched on it. So I figured we can do that. We can do one more and I could show you how I did that. It was pretty fun. If you have these punches, um, uh, so basically what you do is you, you make sure it's lined up with this start here and then um, and then you move it forward. If you don't, If you don't know how to use these punches and you're new to them and then you see it started here on this line. So now I'm gonna move it forward and you want to keep it so that um, your, your, your things are lined up over here so that it's lined up also inside to continue the punching. See that? Now it's continued and I'm just gonna do that one more time so that it's continued in here like that. And there we go. And it'll be continued on there. Just like that. In case you're new to making punches. Um, and they're cute to do on your paper. They're nice. Uh, maybe I'll pull out one more and we can do another, a different kind. Hold on one second. I'll pull out one more. And we'll do this one and I'm just going to do the same thing I'm going to start um, 
I'm starting, you know, I'm lining up my eye to where it's starting on here. And then I'm going to punch. I'm going to check to make sure. Oh, oh, sometimes these get stuck. There we go. And then it's okay if some things don't get don't get in there. Um, in the punch, you just you just cut, just cut it, no big deal. Okay, and then I'm gonna move it down and line it up here on the design already on the paper, and then punch. Sometimes it's tricky when you work with the um, rag paper. But that's okay. You could still, you could try it. You could try anything. And then I'm gonna move it down one more. Line it up. Mm -hmm. Make sure it gets in there. <laughs> Sometimes it's a little tough to line it all up, but if you try, you'll get it. There we go. And then you could always just take your scissors and cut if it doesn't come all out from the rag paper. No big deal. It's not a big deal at all. It looks pretty. And this didn't get it at the end, but it's embossed a little from where it was going to cut, so it's okay. And sometimes these little things don't come out, <laughs> and that's okay too. Okay, see how cute? Doesn't that look nice lined up on the um, book page like that? So you could do this with the book page and you could also do it with digitals. Okay, and it's it's neat to do on coffee dyed paper too. Uh, you could do that on coffee dyed paper or hand dyed paper. But it looks pretty cool, right? Okay, so that's one. Oh yeah, let me show you a different thing. Uh, oh no, maybe I'll show you after. <laughs> I'll, show, I'll show you after. That's what I'll do. Oops. We'll do it after. Okay. So let's put this in the garbage here real quick. And then um, I have these pieces here that uh, was in my. Um, I for, I always forget what these are called on camera. <laughs> I do. Um. <laughs> this is funny the word will come to me but the photographs come on them and this is the back of the photograph uh, this is the backs but I do have a kit with the photographs and children in my shop so I'm going to um, corner around this it's white on the inside I didn't back it it is on linen paper oh my goodness <laughs> bad. This thing is bad sometimes. There we go. Okay, so I have this one, and then I have one that I already went ahead and cut out. I'll go ahead and round these corners for this one. Like this. Whoopsie. How are all of you? I hope you are all well. Oh, this thing. And give it a spanking. <laughs> it's not working right. Okay, we did it all. No, not this side. Oh my goodness. Come on now. Okay, now we have two. Alright, so what I thought was um, to get some papers of all different sorts. Um, I have all different sorts of papers, you guys. I'm sure you do too if you went looking through your stuff. So I have this. Um, this is just like in, in miniature, um, in miniature, a little, oh, I have, oh, I printed ones out like this. Let's use this. Here, we'll go ahead and cut that off there. And what I did was took my, my invoices, if you have those, if you have invoices or letters um and i printed them out um i believe it was like three by five i think or four by six what is it let's see 
three and a half by one, two, three, four, five. Yeah, three by five because then, or it was four by six probably, and this didn't take up the whole page. So I did that to um, some of my prints for the letters. So if you have that, you can tell your printer to cut them out smaller, you know, and, and that, or to, um, to cut them out, to print them out smaller so that you can do little things with them like this. <laughs> it's fun because we all know that this letter is bigger than what it is, but it's just fun to look at it little. <laughs> it's fun. I hope that you are all well. And I'm doing um, better today than I was yesterday. I don't even, yesterday was a blur to me, you guys. It really was. I was in a, I, I don't know, I was in some kind of a s different world yesterday in my head. I don't even know how I got through the video. I don't even know. I don't remember. It's much of a blur. My sister is coming home early, so I'm happy about that. She'll be home tomorrow. Or, yeah, she'll be home tomorrow. Okay. I have some of these, too, um, from the bee kit. This is from the My Porch Prints. So let's put some of those in there. Some of these little... This is like a whole page of ephemera, you guys. This is really cute. I like the My Porch Prints. Um, uh, she has, like, you know, lots of different little elements to add to... Um, if you're making some sort of, um, like, um, if you're making some sort of a book with a theme, with a theme, she has lots of different, um, things on one, you know, on one page, cute little things. So let's do, well, we're already going towards a bee theme, so let's keep that up then. <laughs> we'll, we'll go towards a little bee theme here. Oh, and, the, and that matches the, the backs match. What are those called? Oh my gosh, that's going to bother me. I need to take a look. I wonder, I wonder, can I see on my page? Um, there's a name. There's a name, you guys. Where is it? Oh my gosh, that's going to bother me. I have to look, you guys. Um... Cabinet cards. Oh my goodness. That's the word. I always forget it. Cabinet cards. I always forget it. So maybe you can even do this with a real cabinet card. Oh no, you can't. No, not what I'm doing. You can't do it with real ones. <laughs> but you can do stuff with real cabinet cards. Uh, Heather Heather has that little book that, I, that inspired me. She did that with cabinet cards, you guys. Um, let's see what else I have here. Oh, I have these little things. These little things here. I like these little things. I'm going to be making a kit out of these soon. Um, I'll have them in my shop. These are my own personal, um, my own personal ephemera. So, I will put them in my shop soon. I'll cut that off there and that off there. Okay, there we go. And how about this one? I always think this this has my son's name, but it doesn't. It says Lou or Lou. I think it's like um uh, oh I forget what the word is now in French. I forget. Okay, here we go. There, one for there. And do I have any more? Oh, how about these little tickets? These are cute. Let's see. We can use this. Oh, I just got an idea, you guys. Uh, let's see. Let me use this. Let me do something with this. I don't know what. Hold on. Let's see. And we have these things too. We can use these. I hope everyone is well. I have been I have been uh, uh, nesting today. <laughs> 
not like a bee. <laughs> I've been cleaning and just kind of revamping and taking taking a little time for myself. It's been a lot this month, you know. My aunt and, and my mother-in-law. Um, it's a little rough when it keeps coming at you, you know. A little, a little rough. It can be a little rough. <clears throat> Let me see here. I'll get this off there. And here. This little piece here. Whoops. That's okay. Sometimes it looks better when, you know, you accidentally rip part of the page. Sometimes it does. Um, let me rip these tickets. And then... I'll show you what I'm doing. I'm leaving uh, to go to my children, so I'm I'm really I'm really gonna try to have some videos done. Um, but there is a chance that I might not, and um, so you know I'll just extend my 100 day project, or maybe I'll double up and post when I get back. Um, some videos, you know, I'll shorten the videos a little bit and just post a little project to do um, and call it the number that it would be. Where's my little thing here? Okay, so I'm going to ink up around these little tags. Well, I didn't even get all the white off. Now I'm just going to cut it. Doesn't bother me none to cut it. Okay, so now they're like little tickets. This is cute. Maybe I'll ink up around this. And... <coughs> oh. <coughs> I didn't bring my water over here. Excuse me. Okay. And then this one. I think I have to sneeze too. Would you believe it? I might. I might not. Okay. We're almost done here. And then I'll show you what I'm doing. These are so cute. And <clears throat> it just came to me when I put the camera on. Um, I was going to do something else. I, we will take our field trip and go outside when I come back. Because I do want to do those things. I just... Um, haven't been able to get outside <laughs> and with everything going on um you know I'm lucky I get up here in the studio <laughs> okay I want these in there too the more the more the merrier you guys the more the merrier let's do this And then I'll ink that up. So yeah, the the um, my porch prints, and this is like her beekeeper or bumblebee kit. It has like a lot of different little things in there. It's adorable, you guys. It's really cute. A lot of different little stuff. A camera. Okay. All right. Now let's see. Let's let's see what we were gonna do. Oh, I wanted. Let me do this first. I'm gonna. I'm gonna back this with. Hmm. Should I back this on here? Is it gonna fit? I think it will. Let me do that. I'm gonna back this on on here. And I'm going to just glue it up and I'm going to fussy cut it out. Yes. I need a glue book. Where'd it go? Oh, boy. Got stuff to my side there. <clears throat> oh, I remember this show. <laughs> I used to love that show. 911. The dogs. He was a dog whisperer I think or something okay put this over 
here. Put this back here. Oopsie, come on. Don't don't mess around with me. <laughs> okay. As long as it gets on there. Um, maybe we'll do this one too. <clears throat> yeah, but I won't. I'll just cut it out around the square. I know what I'm doing. I think. <laughs> I think so. I have an idea. That's good. Okay. My sister says she's having fun. And, um, she's fishing, you guys. <clears throat> I just hope that, well, I'm going to be away. And when, when she gets back, I'll be away for two days. <clears throat> um, taking care of everything with my family. And then I think I should be back on Friday. I should be. I I probably will be back on Friday, 1,000%. <clears> and then I got to get ready because my son has his show. Okay. So I'm going to cut this out of here like this. It has a little bit of a... It's a little bit more sturdy. Maybe I should have used the cutter. Huh. I'll let that dry a minute. So I can... Well, let me see. Can I? Oh yeah, I can clip the corners. Sometimes it gets stuck with the glue. Am I recording? Okay, good. <laughs> that would be a shame. I would be very, very sad. Oh, where's my thing? What happened to it? <clears throat> Oops. It was hiding. It was hiding. Okay, so I'm just going to ink up around these edges. I have a plan for this little piece here. I do. Let's see how it's going to roll. How the plan is going to roll, I don't know. I have a plan for this guy, too. So, I'm going to fussy cut him out. If I can. <laughs> Hopefully. Hopefully, I'll be able to get a little bit of his legs. <laughs> They're tiny. I got a little bit. <clears throat> That's all that matters. Then you'll know he's... Then you'll know he's got legs. And I gotta get the antenna too. Mm. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm, let me just get this guy out here without cutting off anything from him. And then I'll be able to talk more. <laughs> oh, so I was saying that I hope my sister can get my my dress done for my son's festival. <clears throat> I do hope so. Um, she said she's going to try. I need to be here and stuff to try it on while she's sewing. But um, she's going to come too to New York. She's going to come to the services. My, my kids... Seem to be doing okay. I thought they were going to take it harder. And I think I'm the one taking it harder. <laughs> I think so. Okay. Almost. Almost. I hope I can get this done. I think so. I think I'll be able to. As soon as I get this fussy cut out. Okay. <clears throat> it's cool here. Thought it was going to be warmer this week. <clears throat> it's very cool here. Oh, look at this. We're almost done. We are. We're almost done. Okay. We are done. 
All right, so now, put this here, put this here. It's backed. See that? Oh, I like that side better. You guys, I like that side better. I don't know. <laughs> Maybe I might keep that side. All right, so what my thought was is that we can make this into a little, um, a tiny little, what do you call it? Document holder. A tiny one, you guys. Tiny. Yes. Tiny. Mini. A mini one. <laughs> a mini document holder. Just something really cute. Why not? Something something pleasing to the eye. Maybe we can fold this back on itself like this. And put that there. And maybe this can be like a page tab at the bottom. Why not? Let's do that. Let's... Oh, oh, my little stapler. Oh, now I don't even know if I have any more of those over here. And, oh, I always do that. And I, I always forget how this goes, too. Um, let's see. I do. These tiny little staples. Tiny, tiny. Okay. Um, this way, I think. Oh, no. I hope it's the right way. No, I put them in the wrong way. I always do that. I gotta, who else does that? I gotta, like, figure it out first. Whoopsie. I think. Is it this way? Oh, don't mind me, because I get this wrong. Um, maybe I had it in right the first time. I get this wrong every single time. It takes me a minute. Maybe that was the right way. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> it takes me a minute. Because it's not a normal stapler. That was the right way. Okay. So we'll go here, and then maybe we'll put this in. I already did one there. Put that there, and we'll put this here, and we'll take our little, oh, our little, uh-oh, uh -oh, it's not in here. It's right next to me. It's right next to me, you guys. There we go. Let's see how this is going to go. So we will put this together this way. I'm going to do it upside. Oh, maybe that way. There we go. And put this like this and fold this down. Well, evenly. It's not folded evenly. Hold on. I'm going to turn it around so I can get it folded evenly. I'll get it. Don't worry. I got it. I got it. <laughs> okay. And now, how many inches is this? One, two, three, four. So maybe we'll do one here. Let me get that in there. Small. We'll do the small hole. And maybe I'll just put that in there because of the fact that I have to hold it. Okay. I didn't, I didn't put a thing on it. Silly me. I'm using rose gold, this color. It's like a rose gold color. It's pretty. Oh yeah, I like it. And then mm, here, the way. Whoops. There we go. Okay. I'm going to put this one in and close it up. Did I get everything in there that I wanted to? No. 
So we could put this in like just like this after. That's fun. Oh, and this, this too. We'll put that in. Like that. Okay. Look how cute. And now we're just going to fold it up on itself, you guys. Um, this way. To make like a little mini. Isn't that darling? So cute. A little mini one. How cute. I love it. It's not going to be perfect. Because I didn't even test this out first, you guys. I just turned the camera on. <laughs> okay. Let's bring this back just a little bit. And then we'll bring this over. So it's not folded in there. Look at that. I love it. All right, let's do this one. We'll do this one. Um, let's see. Oh, where were those papers? I wanted to use those. Let's use one in there. Let's do that. That would be pretty. And then, maybe not that one. And then this. And this. And that. And we'll ink up around this edges here. The timer's gonna go off, you guys. I'll stay with you until I finish this because I have an idea in mind on closing them. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, let's see. Let's, let's do the same kind of a concept here. And we will use this tag at the bottom. Or maybe at the side. Maybe we'll do it at the side. Should we leave it open? So, yeah. We'll leave it open. And put a staple on there. <laughs> and do that and that. And then we'll leave these for after. So... How cute these little things. They're mini. Minis. Okay. Let's fold this down on itself. Whoopsie. Fold that down. And we'll go ahead and punch. I'm gonna I'm gonna get a little clip though this time to make it easier. So, um, here and here. Okay, look at that. That's easy. All right. I gotta find my little hole. And that was here. And then here. Okay. And this one we'll use gold. <clears throat> use the tiny one. Gold. Oh no, I don't like the gold one on this one. We'll use like a brassy color. Whoops. Okay. Close that up. And then I don't want to lose all these. And this one, I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to put these little things on there like that. So we can add them in in the end part. <laughs> and like that. How cute. And get it through the paper. There we go. Okay. There we go. And I can take that off now. And now we can fold this up. Put that down, and we'll just fold that up midway, make our crease, and then fold this over like that. Look how cute! Oh my goodness, you guys, how adorable! And they could just put this in a pocket. But let's let me just check something out here. I was doing something before, where'd it go? 
I had something before. I don't know where it went. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Where'd it go? Mm -hmm. Hold on. Because that was my thought. That was my thought. Um, is to like, we'll take a piece of vellum and the whole punch thing. I'm going to punch out the vellum, you guys. I'm going to punch out vellum. Do it this way. And you guys can punch vellum too. That's fun. I better close that up before I break it all. Okay. There we go. Oh, I think it moved. It did. Let me start over. Let me start over, you guys. Because it moved. You can't go moving the vellum. Mm-mm. Okay. Start again. I need to put it in front of me. Move this stuff out of the way. And now I can start. And don't you move. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's better. Don't move now. <laughs> Keep going. I forget how many I did. I gotta concentrate, you guys. Otherwise, I'll mess it up. I don't want to move. I don't want it to move. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Should be the last one. There we go. Okay. So, it always it makes a mess too. So, you have this piece of vellum with your stuff that you just um, punched out. And then I thought maybe if we took it off there. And I'm guessing you could do this with paper too. There we go. It leaves you with this piece done. And here, let's take this out. Let's take this off here. Let's see what happens. We'll just see. I don't know. We'll see. Yeah, that's cute. I like that. I didn't take all the paper out of it, though. Let's go ahead and do that. And then I figured maybe we can use this. I mean, it's such an intricate thing. Um, let's see, maybe, uh, we'll get a scissor, and we'll do, we'll make it like a little belly band, <clears throat> like that, and then, um, do I have any, uh, washi tape here, do I, do I, do I, washi tape, where'd you go, I had some, I don't know where it went, Okay. Um, I have some gold washi tape. I hope it comes off. <laughs> okay. You're punking me. There we go. Alright, so I'm just going to... I'm going to do this loosely, though. You know, you don't want to do it too tight so that you can... Take it on and off. Let's put a piece there. The gold. There we go. Look at that. Okay. And then how about... Let me just cut this a little bit back. Like that. And then I thought... This was my thought, you guys. Although, maybe it might look better on this one. Yeah. I think it might. Let's take it off here, and we'll put it on this one, like this. Yeah, I like that. And then, we'll just put a little bit of glue 
I like this side better than that side. Although, they both look cute. But I think I'm going to do this side, you guys. So, I'm just going to put this right here. Um, I'll put this on the glue. I mean, I'll put the glue on the tape. There we go. I'm just going to put it right there. Oh, okay. Isn't that cool? And then when the glue dries, let's do this one. Let's see. Um, cut that here. And then we'll do it loosely, not too tight. And we'll do we'll use this glue, this tape again. Hopefully the glue is gonna stick there. I didn't think because it's metallic, but it should. And we'll do it this way. Make sure it's not staying on the paper. Okay. And here. Is that is this gonna be too big? Hmm. No. It might be. Hold on. <clears throat> it might no. I think it'll work. I think it will. We'll go ahead and we'll just give it a try. Do some there. There. Oh yeah. See? Just gotta dry all the way though. It will. And there we go. Those are the closures. Look how cute. I like this one. Isn't that darling? Oh, I like it. And then here. Here's our little paper. A little mini document folder. It's cute. All right, you guys. Thank you for joining me today. Blessings to all of you. And I will see you again. Uh, I will see you again soon. All right. Uh, tomorrow is Tuesday. Yeah. I'll see you tomorrow. I'll see you tomorrow, Tuesday. Day. Day. Um. 63. Oh, let me get this back in here then I won't be able to function. Yeah. If it doesn't, if my plan doesn't work. Okay, it is. It will. Get in there. There we go. It's not already dry. Good thing I did that before the video ended. Okay, so let the vellum dry with the glue because it does take a little extra time first. And don't do it too tight. This way you'll be able to fold it on and off. Pull it on and off. There we go. Okay. Blessings to all of you. Thank you so much for joining my channel. And I'll see you guys again soon. Uh, tomorrow, actually. <laughs> I'm going to take this off here. Um, maybe. Hey. <laughs> all right. It's now the foolproof plan. Let this dry first. Let that dry first. And then maybe put a, where's tape? Come on. We'll do this. Put a piece of tape on the back side after you glue it. So that, and just enough to cover your paper. So that um, the glue isn't going to get on your, isn't going to get on your um, pull in and out. Because I have some glue. So... Let's back that up, you guys. <clears throat> Lucky thing I stayed with you. You would have been mad at me if you would have put these together and they would have fallen apart on you or glued together. <laughs> okay, so go ahead and and I will put... Um, where'd the tape go? I, I don't know what's wrong with me. Put a little piece of tape back in there to cover up the glue. The spot of glue. I'm just going to go right inside there like that and cover it. Okay, there we go. Now it will work. It will work just fine now. 
so cute little belly bands. You could use your, and you don't have to use your puncher either. You could just do a belly band and, and um, cut something out and use it for the, you can cut out a circle and use it for the, the viewpoint, the focal point. Okay. Bye for now, my crafting buddies. I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.